this group of West Army Bowl quarterbacks has been really solid top to bottom this year. Uh, but I'd say the most impressive has been USC's JT Daniels. If for no other reason than he's been the most consistent. Just came in. Here's a guy who was our number number one player in class of 2019. Reclassifies to 2018. Technically should still be a junior. And he arrives in San Antonio as the most calm, cool, collected, poised guy of that quarterback group, if not the entire you know, West team has those leadership intangibles. Really just been impressed with uh, the way he's carried himself this week. But also then been very impressed with the physical tools. I mean, this, this kid has an arm. He's, he's really fun to watch play the quarterback position, throw the football. He made a pass in the Alamo Dome when they went 7-on-7 seven seven to Brennan Eagles where he put it in the spot nobody else could put it, really. I, I mean, it had to be across the field 30 yards. Plenty of velocity, ball arrives on time. It was a big boy throw. Really showed me a lot about JT Daniels. He's done that throughout the week. He has plenty of arm strength, but he also has that understanding of when to throttle back and when to throw the uh, take a little bit off the pass. You know, he can throw with touch, he can throw with accuracy, and he can fit it in some tight windows, use that that big cannon of an arm when he needs to. So all in all, just my first chance seeing JT Daniels live and in person. He's lived up to the hype, and it was a pretty, pretty strong hype coming in.